Hey guys, what's up? It's your boy Max Speed 7 here. Um, I'm gonna be a little bit quiet because my sister's right downstairs and she can hear everything. But um, I failed at a unboxing video. I don't know if I uploaded it or not. We'll see. Uh, if anything, I'll show you a clip here. Hey guys, Max Speed 7 here. It's been a while. <laughs> uh, I decided to post a video because I got a bunch of packages. Uh, I have well more than this, but I have a lot of packages and I'm super excited uh, to get these unpacked and. Um, uh, I don't remember what most of these are, but I know one of them is a special thing, and I want to I want to use it. So I yeah I don't want to spoil it. That's fine. Yeah. Anyways, um, yeah. So this is an unboxing video. Yay. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna start with the bag. And also, yes, I know there's a mess behind me. Blah blah blah. Whatever. Who cares? I don't have time for that. Okay. I started a full time job. I I don't have time for anything. So what is this? Oh, it's a it's a foam cannon. Nice. Ahead to our next item. So yeah, foam cannon. Pretty cool. I actually did remember that. That was one of the items I did remember. Uh, but let's see what else we got here. We got this other box here. Um, also, I'm very tired, so I'm gonna try to make this a very uh, well. I'm gonna try to still make it exciting, you know. But yeah, what have you guys been up to? What are your plans for summer? Please comment. Um, and subscribe, otherwise I'll stab you with this knife. Um, but yeah. <laughs> so, oh, <laughs> yes. That's right. Okay, I'll, we have a little lavalier mic. So, actually, you know what, let's hook it up now, see how different the sound is. So, the microphone actually, uh, basically you need an adapter. My camera was wired differently, so that's why I'm doing a voiceover right now. But, let's see what this uh, third package is here. Um, as I cut and almost stab myself right there, as you can see. Yep, we're just going to keep cutting towards ourselves because that's the best way possible. Guess what you guys think it is in the comments. Go ahead. Make your prediction now. Uh, looks like we got some red stuff. Oh, we got some red tubes, red hoses. It's a cold air intake. So if you guessed that, you are correct or you already know that I installed it like two years ago. Uh, so yeah, well, probably, I think it was last year. No, it was 2020, so yeah, two years ago. Um, but yeah, without further ado, let's get back to what we were doing. I bought a new mic that um, <clears throat> is supposed to plug into your phone or camera, but when I plug it into the camera, it doesn't record any audio, so that's why I screwed up. Anyways, uh, so we're gonna go install that now. Uh, it's a new intake for my Honda Accord 2006. So let's go. This is my. This is the first mod I'm doing on this car. Yeah, cold intake, uh, red one. Very nice. So we're gonna go. We're gonna pop the hood. So let's go do that. Okay. So I know this engine bay is really dirty. Anyways, we're gonna be taking out this guy right here. Um, I think just completely. I think this whole box is gonna go away. And then, um, yeah, we just put this guy in. It should fit it. Um, goodly. <laughs> it should fit it very well. Make sure engine is cool. Ooh, yeah, I've been driving it. Disconnect battery terminal. I'm gonna go ahead and disconnect this guy, which I believe it's a uh, ten. Could be. All right. So it looks like the battery terminal is a ten millimeter. So we're just gonna. Loosen that up. Don't want to strip the bolt. <laughs> Take it loose and just put it off to the side. Disconnect the intake from the engine itself. I, I think, okay, yeah, you're just supposed to loosen it and then pull it out. This one's literally held on by a zip tie. I don't know who did that. Maybe I should get plier, pliers for these because this is going to get a pretty hot job. Um, I'll see you guys off over to the side here. So I'm guessing I do have to snip this guy. If anything, I'll just use another zip tie to seal it if anything goes wrong. Perfect. Just toss that to the side. Uh, looks like we have some tubes that just pop out. Uh, yep. As for this guy, it just comes off. I think we have our bigger intake move. So. Okay, so there we go. There's that tube, very dirty. 
Uh, I feel like now would be a good time to clean that throttle body because I do have throttle body cleaner, but I mean, it's not too dirty. I might as well spray it. All right, so yeah, uh, th I did look it up. This stuff is good to use on throttle body cleaner, but throttle body cleaner cannot be used on mass airflow sensor. So, just so you know. I'm just gonna spray it down. Now, usually when you spray this stuff, at least for me, it's a little hard to start the engine the first couple times but after a while you get it. Oh, I see. Wait, what? Oh. Oh, okay. So there's like a tube that goes down into here. It's not, I don't think it really has a purpose. But I guess we'll find out. Probably does, but. I think it's just to get cold air away from the engine. And then it goes up through the filter. Probably should have done some did some research, but I'll look. this is how you learn about cars, kids. You just gotta do it. I'll get it out. Get this whole thing out. And there goes that bolt that I was talking about. There we go. Right, I just want to get this little clip out of here. And there's our intake box. Now I do want to clean this area because as you can see it's a little dirty. I don't know if you can see. It's pretty uh, gloomy outside. It's not gloomy, it's sunny, but it's just that the light, you know. I want to wipe this area down, but first, I don't know, oh no, this is the fuse box. So we don't get rid of this. We're just getting rid of that box. And then, because the intake goes all the way down here under the tire. So I think we just leave that and then just put the new one in. I'm guessing you take that off. I'm guessing. I, don't I think this is just an extra contraption. Oh yeah, yeah, we do. You might have to hold the nuts from under the wheel. I don't know what it's talking about, but we're just gonna continue um, because it doesn't look like we have that screw is like inverted on mine, so that's good. It's this way. Yeah, there we go. Solid. Oh, don't take any of those clamps. Position them loosely so that you can move it around and tighten them later. Connect the supplied hose, hoses to the intake. Okay, I think I know what we're doing. This one's kind of damaged, but it's fine because uh, well, look at those nice welds and they're kind of dirty, but Okay, so what we're supposed to do Actually, let's do This guy first So we're gonna put it into here first. I think this is tube down here. It's like wonky. I don't know. This is I guess this is what you get for uh, $60, $60 intake kit. I heard they're supposed to be like even more expensive, like 300 just for even this piece, but. Yeah, I'm gonna spray all these parts with degreaser so that my finger oils aren't on there just in case it does get hot. And basically just to clean it, you know? But we're gonna do a test fit right now. We're gonna put all the parts together. And hope... Hi. Hi, what's this tower? An intake. Sure? Intake. It's like a, it's 
car. It's like to make my car run better, basically. All right, so I don't know what I missed. Um, I don't know when it stopped recording, but we have this little bracket here to hold the thing, and I think there's like a yeah, there's a layer of plastic on it, which I don't know if I'm supposed to peel or what. Maybe I don't know. I'm not gonna touch it. But what you do know is we got the intake in. She's looking clean, boys. Look at that. Um, so I'm gonna have my mom. It looks, it sounds deeper. Rev it. More. Ooh, that sounds... That sounds more. Let's try... Oh okay, yeah, hold on, hold on. <laughs> my mom's... My mom's kind of happy. Okay, go ahead. More. Ooh, that sounds interesting. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Huh. That's not at all how I was expecting it to sound. Okay, right, so that was kind of weird. I was I not expecting it to sound like that. Sounds more high pitch. I don't know. I'll ask uh, Vadim and Eugene for their advice. Um, because they're usually car experts. And Vadim has a BRZ now, and he has a cold intake on there, so I guess I should ask him. It might be those tubes. I might have to cut them up because uh, they might be traveling too long. But it sounds pretty interesting. I want to go inside the car and hear how it sounds and actually go for a drive. So yeah, let's go do that. So to be completely honest, I <laughs> I have no idea what happened here. Um, maybe I just wasn't thinking. I, I, I don't know how to tell you. But uh, long story short, I guess I never recorded before footage of how the car sounded. So, we're stuck with the after footage. Sorry guys, this is what I have to give you. But, hey, without further ado, let's just listen to it. We're just going to rev it a little. Oh, copyright. Ooh, she sounds nice. Okay, let's take her on the road. Um, I'll have to set the camera up at the end of the at the end of the driveway. There we go. And then we're just gonna let it rip. That's right. I just say it. Let it rip. So yeah, let's go. Let's go, buddy. Okay. So now we have to go on the road. Yes. Okay, ready? Three, two, one, go. Ooh, it sounds nicer when it transitions too. Two, one, go. It sounds nicer when it transitions too. So we're gonna go on first gear. Ooh, I actually skipped a third. A bad. Hold on, let's stop here. Let's go ahead and we're gonna get this into first. into first we just skip that stop sign but it's okay we're doing tests yes it's fine we don't need stop signs in our life stop signs are just more complicated oh, uh, I'm gonna switch it back to drive I'm gonna open the windows see how it sounds dude I love the sound of this car it's so nice People are going to call me racers from now on because I'm going for sound and visual things. Oh, it sounds nice when we do manual. 
I love the sound of it. I don't know if I, I can't see. I can't really tell if it's if it's whatever. It's actually rattling or not. But yeah. So let's go ahead and stop the recording. Where's my phone? That's not good. All right, almost the end of the recording. So we're just gonna have some talk time, just me and you. Yeah. Go some ASMR. Yeah. I don't know what that was. That was like anime mode right there or something. I don't. Don't ask me. I'm gonna set the tripod to the side so I can pull in, and I'm just gonna start narrating everything I do because I have no good content to record. This is why my channel's dying. I mean, it's technically dead already, but. We don't say that around here. Oh, okay. These sunflowers are looking beautiful. Yeah. Alright. Guys, vote on the next uh on the next uh mod.